U.S. President Barack Obama has used his State of the Union speech to warn Congress that he would veto any new sanctions they might levy against Iran during international negotiations to limit the Islamic Republic's nuclear program. The sanctions that we put in place help make this opportunity possible. But let me be clear. If this Congress sends me a new sanctions bill now that threatens to derail these talks, I will veto it. For the sake of our national security, we must give diplomacy a chance to succeed. If Iran's leaders do not seize this opportunity, then I will be the first to call for more sanctions and stand ready to exercise all options to make sure Iran does not build a nuclear weapon. But if Iran's leaders do seize the chance, and we'll know soon enough, then Iran could take an important step to rejoin the community of nations, and we will have re resolved one of the leading security challenges of our time without the risks of war. After years of stalling, Iran agreed in November to slow its uranium enrichment program and permit increased international inspections in return for sanctions relief worth around 7 billion U.S. dollars. Israel, which has repeatedly warned the international community that Tehran cannot be trusted, wants sanctions to remain in place until Iran irrevocably reverses its nuclear plans.